everybody, I'm Tony Fleming from Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Thank you for joining me on today's 911 video and I call them daily driver exotic. You say, Tone, what's, uh, what, what's a daily driver exotic? What's it really mean? Well, what it means is that your significant other can enjoy this car as well too. They're not laying down in a bright red Ferrari uncomfortable. They can enjoy the hobby with you if you want them to, right? If you don't want to share that, you don't have to, of course. But in the case of this car here, this is a usable, usable sports car, better than any other car out there, not to mention this one in particular, super low miles, ridiculous condition, ridiculous condition. And uh, we're gonna spend a few minutes walking around it, show you all those details, and hopefully uh, find a way to get it in your garage. All right, so these are the original 18-inch uh, Carrera classic rims. Caliper still painted the factory black because it's low mileage, right? Cross-drilled rotors in there to get rid of some of the heat and the weight, all right? And they're vented, of course. And then you have just great styling. You know, some people are hard on a 996 because they say it doesn't have just this. It has this piece as well. I think it looks great. I think this is a beautiful car. Don't let anybody uh, say differently. Not to mention price-wise, these compared to say buying a new one uh, is so significantly different. A new one starts at over $100,000 now. This is an incredible, great buy. This one in particular has uh, black metallic paint, what we call basalt. And I'd like to show you the quality of that because Porsche paint is really, really good. And the way you know that is by looking at this here in the light, you can see how clear every letter is in there, right? You can see how clear every letter is in there, uh, the font and how good you can see. That's important. The better that is, the clearer the letters are, the better the factory paint is. You know, the back of this car is super stylish and I did a couple things just to show you a couple things, right? I raised the spoiler for you so you could see what it looks like. When this car hits about 70, uh, the spoiler comes up. But it's so thoughtful of Porsche that the third brake light that's right there, because they wanted this at the right angle, they didn't want to cut price, they didn't want to make it unsafe, they wanted this to be the best sports car ever, they put a third brake light in here because they knew it potentially could block uh, a really low car that was looking at it and that needed to be in place. The polished tips that come out the back, because it's a convertible, it makes it look much wider from behind, right? And then lastly, lastly, uh, look how clean it is in here. It is like brand new. All of the decals are in place like they're supposed to be. Uh, we can tell that the trunk lid hasn't been replaced because uh, it's been an accident or something like that because all that stuff's still there. It's beautifully done. And then if you wanted to do a little touch of your own, you can replace this Carrera emblem with any color you want. We have silver, we have black, uh, we have white. We can uh, uh, leave it just as is because it's kind of a blacked out package on the car. So whatever you want, those are the kind of personal touches we can do to make it your own. Okay, so I wanted to show you why I say this is a daily driver exotic. So first off, uh, this right here, uh, it's kind of nice that this is still in the car. This is the windscreen. It goes behind the seats and it makes a huge difference. Most people think the wind comes in the front windows. It doesn't work that way. It actually comes back around the way a car is designed. And this also folds down while it's inside. So if you don't want it there, you don't have to see it. Secondly, there's two uh, areas of storage, uh, not only behind the seats, but in here you can stack a couple soft bags, all right? Then here, the battery is located right there. And then we talk about things like, have the car been an accident? Because that's an important thing about a new car or used car is something like this. So the decal right here shows all of the options when they were building the car. You can't buy this decal. The decal is still in place. So we know that this hood hasn't been replaced. Just small signs about uh, how well a car is taken care of. And you don't have to leave this in here if you don't want to. You just put it in your house or put it behind the seat. That gives you all that extra room in there. And then we like to point out how to really close the hood on these because they're aluminum and they're super light, right? Uh, instead of putting your hands on and getting two big handprints, we push it right on the emblem, hit the click, and you're good to go. So a couple small details that you may or may not know about, I like to point out. So for instance, here, uh, these are roll bars. These roll bars pop up if the car tilts at all. It has a, a system in there that lets it know that. So it gives you a nice safety feeling here, okay? Secondly, this is the front of the convertible top. It's hard and it's when it's up in here because this is 160 to 200 mile an hour car depending on the model that you buy in the engine. They made this hard so it wouldn't buff it at high speeds. Good thinking, right? Lastly, if you want to, you can take the kids out uh, in the car, right? There's room back here. Two adults can sit back here. You don't want to probably ride to the beach for two hours, but we can sit back here in a pinch. But the kids love it back here because it's a convertible. It makes great sound. However, if you don't need to do that, you can fold these rear seats down, right? Fold these rear seats down. It makes a whole nother package shelf for more luggage or the dog or whatever you want. The best part about the car is walking up to it is great, but getting in it is even better because here, 
is where Porsche shines, right? Porsche is shining because they're building a cockpit for a driver to take to the track. Although it's a daily driver exotic that I keep telling you about, everything is right there for you. 8,000 RPM tack, okay? Uh, nice digital sound system, 200 mile an hour speedometer, right? Uh, this has the Bose sound system in it. Six speed, and the six speed's nice and easy to work. Shifter moves easy. Heated seats, power windows, power locks, keyless entry. So you're getting a real luxury car and a real sports car all wrapped in one. And uh, with ridiculously low mileage, it is a great, great buy. All right, so let's close up the video on this beautiful triple black, triple black 911 Cabriolet, right? Ridiculously low miles, less than 2,000 miles a year has been driven, over 300 horsepower, six speed convertible, right? I get excited about that because I know when you drive this car, the sound it makes, the feel it makes, and the way it handles is why people always talk about uh, Porsche being such an experience, okay? And lastly, if you want to personalize any of the car, you can do a couple small things. We could uh, shoot the rims black if you wanted to, uh, to give you a whole blacked out treatment there. We could paint the calipers red and do the rims in black or yellow uh, on calipers, whatever you want. Those little touches are what you can do to make it your own if you like it. If not, we can leave it just the way it is because this is the way it rolled off the factory floor and in it, it looks really, really great. Anyway, call us, 301-816-1000. We'll tell you all about this uh, triple black 911 super low mileage Cabriolet. And if you don't mind, please click the like button down below there. That helps us uh, get the content out. And if you wanna share it with your friends, that would be great as well. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We're putting out content all the time. I think you really, really enjoy it. And lastly, I will see you on the test drive. The unmistakable sound of a 911, it just sounds like no other car. All right, so listen, we're taking out the 911. We're enjoying why you'd buy a 911, and that is for that sound and the feel of being connected to a car, right? Look how easy the shifter and the wheel work together. The chassis is solid. I mean, listen, 911 has won so many races in the world for a reason, but it doesn't have to be raced. It's such a cool car just to go for a drive. Imagine going out to the country or driving someplace a little bit farther for dinner with a significant other. And listen to the sound, up and down of the revs, attack is in your face. We're just whipping around the corners. You know, we're driving the speed limit, but it just goes right around the corner with zero, zero effort. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the drive and I'll see you on the next one.